do you have anxiety no you didn't miss your me i said anxiety now in case you're wondering what anxiety is it's really simple actually it's january and anxiety put together i'm sure some of you smiled or even laughed but sadly anxiety is a real deal studies have shown that january is a stressful month for many people and anxiety is running high wait are you wondering what anxiety means let me explain first of all i'm dr iradatta and welcome to mind wellness please subscribe to our channel if you like the videos that you're getting on mental health coming back to anxiety anxiety is a condition in which one worries and worries a lot worries for no apparent reason actually worries about general themes which you and i may actually not find really daunting so it could be when will be my child coming back from school will she be okay what will happen in the future wait how will i get this work done even mundane themes like what if i die who will take care of the others and so on and so forth now these themes once in a while are okay but when they become the epicenter of your life it is an issue this starts taking a toll on your sleep your appetite your work and even your relationships so jumping back to anxiety why is anxiety happening to people simple reasons really after all the festivities christmas new year so many more things and all the fun we find our spirits suddenly taking a plunge and this overwhelming fear of going back to mundane routine comes back add to it the weather oof it's really cold isn't it there's so many parts of the world which are really cold and this push pushes our colds even back it's not an easy time of the year so many of us are making promises aka resolutions and when we falter we start having anxiety oh my god i couldn't even keep up my resolution for a week let's also talk about students i mean exams are literally around the corner right you know exams are always making everyone a bit anxious i know they made me anxious there's got to be a solution for anxiety right the solutions are always always there take each day as it comes stop living in the future stop living in the past as well start living in the moment that is the present moment mindfulness is a great practice to help focus on the present moment and even reduce anxiety as is exercising it brings back routine it also reduces the excessive adrenaline that your body is producing which is responsible for the anxiety now if you're making changes you might also want to cut down on certain things in your diet cut back on the alcohol and even cut down on that extra cup of coffee excessive coffee is known to make people more anxious and in winters we all have that extra cup right and finally find your own personal stress buster it could be art it could be therapy it could be going for a walk it could be dancing it could be anything which works for you hope the rest of your january is spent without any anxiety i'm dr eradatta consultant neuropsychiatrist therapist and life coach signing off if you're interested in more videos from us please comment subscribe and we'd be happy to bring out more stuff on mental health